Hi, it's Ashley. I'm here for Live Happy Tarot to do a deck review of one of my newest decks. It's the Future Ancestors Tarot by Lexa Luna Studio. Every time I say that, Sorry, Alexa sure. talks. <laughs> um, this is a great little deck. It says the cards were created as a gentle reminder to live in gratitude for the steps our ancestors took to get us to where we are here and now. May the magic embedded in each card serve you with love in our past as future ancestors for generations to come. So that's why it's called Future Ancestors. For a moment at the beginning, I wasn't quite sure where the future ancestors came from, but we are the future ancestors. So the, it comes in a nice tuck box. I will have to say that this tuck box is actually a better one uh, because I can actually get the cards out. Sometimes it's really hard to open tuck boxes. Inside the box, of course, are the cards, and we have a little guidebook. Um, isn't it pretty? The guidebook is very simple, just a couple pages. It has um, how it came to, how this deck came to be. It was found, Alexa Luna Studios was founded by Alexa Villanova, Villanueva, a Filipina American artist. Um, and it was during a deep period of grief. And so it has a little thing about all the majors and some of the majors have been renamed and then um, the minors have been renamed. We have candles for fire, cups for water, needles for air and seeds for earth. So candles for wands, cups for cups, needles for swords and seeds for pentacles or discs, whichever one you want and the cards. So the cardstock is, I don't know if you can see it right there. It's, a, it's the woven cardstock. Um, some, I had a deck where I felt like it really took away from the artwork, but this deck, I don't, it doesn't take away anything from the artwork. You can still see all the beauty in the art. Um, and they're um, kind of slippery cards. So nice for shuffles. And let's go ahead and look at the card. So of course we have the fool. I really like this fool. I love the yellow flowers. So we have the alchemist, or alchemist, sorry, instead of the magician. We have the high priestess. This is like one of my favorite cards. The empress, again, a fave. The emperor. Virtue. So here we've changed one of the names. That's the higher fan. The lovers, I like this one. The chariot, strength. So you'll see that these are not exactly like, they're not Rider Waite Smith copies, which is nice. The hermit, the wheel. I think, I just feel like I really like the artwork. It's simplistic, justice. And yet it takes you to a maybe a place, metamorphosis, where you can understand what she's feeling, death, temperance, the devil. I had somebody comment on one of my posts, the tower, that this seems like a very gentle deck, and I would agree. The star, the moon. the sun. I like how um, there's different body shapes in this. Judgment. The world. Maker of cups. And a lot, some of the people are very androgynous and some of them aren't. So, um, maker, sorry. Maker of cups, this is the king. Listener of cups, this is the queen. Explorer of cups, knight and Student of Cups page. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, love this one, two of cups, and the ace. 
And next we have the candles. <laughs> this is the maker of candles. The listener. The explorer. And the student. We have the 10, 9, I like the third eye up there. Eight, seven, six, <laughs> five, four, three, two, and the ace. That's what I feel like she's saying. Then we have the seeds. And again, the seeds are pentacles or earth, you know. And we have the maker. And then the listener. And the explorer. And finally, the student. 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, I like this one. Five, I think this one's beautiful too. Four, three, two, and here we go to the ace. Very, very beautiful card. And the last suit we have are the needles. This is the maker. This is the listener. This is the explorer and the student. And then we have the 10. This one's a little bit disturbing, I have to say. Nine, eight, seven, six. I like how she's sitting on the needle. Five, four. This one reminds me of camping. <laughs> Three, two and the ace and there you go that is a walkthrough of the future ancestors tarot by lexa luna studios <laughs> thank you guys for watching